guys, Google 55 Tech Tutorials here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to change the font on your iPhone, iPod Touch, and or iPad. First off, you are going to need a jailbroken iDevice. If you need to jailbreak, you can look up a video here on YouTube or check my channel to see if I have a tutorial corresponding to your device. This will change the font of everything on your device, but it is definitely reversible. The first thing that you're going to want to do is go ahead and open up Cydia. Wait for it to finish refreshing, and then you can go ahead and click search. Click on the search bar at the top and type in Bita font. That's B-Y-T-A-F-O-N-T. And go ahead and click search. When this comes up, you want to click on Bita font. Click install. And then click on confirm. So you're just going to want to wait for this to finish downloading. And then when it does, you can go ahead and click Return to Cydia. Next, you're going to want to click on the Home button. And Cydia might take a second or two to close, or maybe more. But when it does, you should see a new icon on your home screen called Bite Font. Mine is right there. It probably won't be white like mine. Mine's just white because my iPhone is messed up. But anyways, you want to go ahead and open it. And now here comes the fun part. Now you can go to browse fonts and you are going to want to wait for this page to load. It's normal if it takes a while, but once it has loaded, you can scroll down to view the different categories of fonts. You can choose whichever one you want, but I'm just gonna choose most recent. Okay, now I can scroll down and choose the font that I want. Clicking one will give me some photos showing how the font looks. If you see one that you like, which in this case is this one right here for me, you can scroll down and tap install. This will bring up Cydia with the font you want to install. Just go ahead and click install and then confirm. Wait for that to download, and then once again, when that is done downloading, we can click Return to Cydia. Once again, we'll want to click the Home button, and just wait for Cydia to exit, and open up by the font again. You want to go to Basic, and then you will see the font that you downloaded here. Click it, and when this comes up, hit yes. Your device will take a minute to respring, and when it does, you will see here that the font has changed to the font that I chose. Now if we go ahead and unlock it, you can also see that the font of my text messages have changed. Now this had cha this just changed everything in your device. So if you ever want to change it back, then it is really simple. All you have to do is open up by font, go to basic once again at the bottom, and then click restore original. When this comes up, click yes. Your device will respring again, and when it comes back on, it will now be set to Apple's default font. So, thanks for watching. I hope that this video helped. If you have any questions, comments, or tutorial suggestions, leave them in the comments below, or send me a message. Don't forget to subscribe if you want to get news, tutorials, and yeah, go ahead and like Gaguda55 Tech Tutorials on Facebook, and follow Gaguda55 Tech Tutorials on Twitter to get the latest news. All the links are in the description.